if it's in the... I don't even know if I got the drone in there. Where are you going? <laughs> He's way up there. Drone lesson. Numero, I don't know what. I haven't had the drone out for a while. But I figured out how to stabilize on the program that I use to edit videos. So, I want to use this when we go to Schooly Palooza. So, hopefully, we can get this figured out. <laughs> I told him. <laughs> I told him to fly through the goalposts. You did very good. <laughs> Turn on the camera now. Make sure. Huh? It is? It is? Cool. Because, uh, I gotta see if I can. Does it take just what's underneath it, or does it get like the playground and stuff? Oh, there's the park ranger over there. There's Sister Beth behind him. She's sun tanning. <laughs> what? The leaves. The leaves are what? Flapping. Oh. Like it would on a helicopter. Oh. I can't even see it in here. Hello, little drone. Are you showing up on the camera? Doing. There's him over there. Ah, you be careful. Don't. I will pick it out of the air. <laughs> okay, today, gloomy day here in Arizona. You can see, I'm not even going to go outside. It's raining. 52 degrees. Uh, December, I think it's the 28th today. Well, today we're going to have the uh, uh, glass people come out and repair this crack in the window. There's a little chip right here. And I want to take care of that before it gets any worse. It's cheaper now than if I did the whole window. So that's what we're doing today. And he'll be here in a little while. I don't know, maybe an hour or two. And we'll go from there. So that mirror just kind of helps you see it? Yeah, so I can see where to put the machine. Yeah. That wire's got me twice now, or the mirror. That's just infuses it with something or? It's sucking mm -hmm. and it sucks air out and then it forces resin in and it you know, goes back and forth. Oh, okay. It tries to suck as much air out as possible and then it forces the resin in. Does it completely disappear then? The reason we can't say it completely disappears is because of the dirt being in there. Yeah. It, like when you're a little kid and you threw rocks in the ground and left a dirt spot, yeah. the windshield actually accepts some of that dirt oh. and it won't, it's too heavy to pull out. <coughs> so be, that's why we can't say it's a cosmetic repair. Well, the uh, glass is repaired. 
I guess. You can still see it, but there's a warranty that says that it will not crack and crack out. If it does, it's got a warranty and they'll replace the glass. So good enough for me. It's wow. a very no, I haven't. It's a <laughs> well, re read the sign. Holy shit. <laughs> I love it. Look at the tape. It's all toilet paper. Happy birthday. Oh. Happy birthday. Oh. There you go. Oh, my gosh. So, oh, that's so gorgeous. I'd never seen that. Oh, no. They did that for Bethy when she turned 60, and I wasn't there, so I never saw it. Now, you have to open up the cards when you get to that. You can yeah. do that one later. If you yeah. want, but when you get to it, you have to open them up in order, and yeah. then uh, oh, oh, yeah. There, there's, a, there's more to the story. Yeah. You want to park my car? Yeah. You got to stay for this. It's aren't fine you? right there, huh? Yeah. It's fine right there. Yeah, but um, yeah, nobody. Else. Oh, Esther's coming. I mean, Rusty. Rusty. He's all this good. Away. <laughs> Happy birthday to Beth. Tell her. Happy, Happy birthday, Beth. Happy birthday. birthday. I talked to you already. Oh, well, you already did. Happy birthday, Happy birthday, Happy birthday sister. <laughs> We're going to send you this. Yep. Good luck. Win a bunch of money so you can give us some. <laughs> We're on our way up to Tortilla Flats. Here's one of the crazy bridges. This road is a little um, spooky if you're not a person that's a fan of heights such as myself. <laughs> but anyways, um, Scott's sisters came to visit, uh, Kathy and Barb. So we're going to take a little jaunt up to Tortilla Flats and see what we can find.
water come down over this road. It's so much rain in the last couple of days, and I'm sure it just takes a little while for it to come down and up. Pretty crazy. You don't find this all the time up here. I think there was a big flood in 2019. If I remember correctly, it's in an old video too, and like the uh, Roosevelt Dam, and we found out all that history about how this Apache Trail was built. And very interesting, I tell ya. The stuff as humans we used to endure to be able to get places. I guess travel is that uh, innate in our human. DNA or something, I don't know. This scoundrel right here stole my dollar. And where I found that gold. I love to dream and wonder. Didn't give me my fortune. It will again. Give up the bounties of the treasures to some lone and struggling man. Take it all back. He did give me my fortune. I <laughs> just had to listen to him yap for a while. We'll see what it says. Oh, I was going to say, I thought it was dry docked there for a minute. See all that water? Yeah. yeah this looks like mud. Mud or what? Or just crap that went floating down the yeah, I don't know if that's how long that's been there either. There we go. <laughs> Where have we been all six years? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, and what's no, your name there? Real. Oh, Digger. I These see. are my corn cob eating teeth because I'm going to country buffet after this. Oh. <laughs> Woohoo! Hi, kiddos. Take a picture of him. Take I got, a picture. You got Hello there. Take a picture. <laughs> Welcome. Are you taking she, a video or I'm a doing camera? a video. Oh, I you didn't know. You just keep on just going. I'm staring at the camera. camera. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I fell off my horse yesterday. That explains a lot. <laughs> it does. Yeah, it does. <laughs> Woohoo, thank you. Oh, thanks for coming, folks. Yeah. Take care. <laughs> it's the history booth. Oh, I don't think that's pretty. A little history. Anybody want one? Anyone? Lots of useless facts you didn't know, never use again. 2020, 38,000. There will be a written test tonight. Just send them to me, I have the answers. Oh, perfect. And if I don't know it, I'll make it up. Take this you for a minute. <laughs> All right, well, I'm just videoing, I think. Oh, yeah, I am. You're getting a video. <laughs> Yeehaw! <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo. Oh, yeah.
So my uncle Dwayne and Aunt Camilla came to Arizona from Wisconsin for a visit. And Dwayne had texted earlier um, ahead of time that he had wanted to visit the Pima Air and Space Museum. So I contacted my girl Cassidy in Tucson. And by chance, she actually had a, a day free. And she offered to show for us around Tucson, which was really appreciated. Um, so we wanted to see her new house anyway. So Scott, I, and Dwayne motored to Cassidy's home first. And we got the tour of her fabulous, huge home. And then she drove us to the Air Museum from there. So great day. Follow along. I'll show you part of it anyways. Actually, this is a, it's a huge museum, and it really um, deserves its own video which i will do so if you really like planes and you're interested in that there'll be another one um just of the pima air museum so hang tight here it comes though yeah. and orange with my t-shirt and what i was like having to plan around what sweater i could wear <laughs> <laughs> oh we still are getting old people cold you know what i mean well, I could, yeah i could use less clothes but nobody else would want that <laughs> <laughs> Well, there's that. Oh, no, today, actually. Yeah, it's it beautiful. Is. Yeah. It was supposed to be 75 at the peak, but... It's a huge place. We went out here for Parker's birthday. We did an airsoft party. Oh, really? He and five of his friends got to go out there and shoot each other. <laughs> uh, down in Mississippi, they have a uh, space shuttle uh, engine testing facilities. Mm, went through that. Boy, that's something else. Is that by Biloxi there, or Mobile? Um, it's in the coast? It's actually not far from, uh, 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 not too far from the French Quarter.
There she is. <laughs> yeah, she really did that. 